Yeah, we've got remaining in the EU by the back door, and I'm loving it. <laughs> Very good. I, I, Very good. I, I, no, no, I, but Patrick, I agree with you. Yeah. I think if I was a Remainer, I'd be cock a hoop at what she's I doing. What, I, used, I used to be one of your biggest fans uh, economy, back a couple of years ago, but about, about one year ago, I feel like I started to wake up and smell the coffee and, and realising that we used to be one of the big bullies um, within the EU. Banks really like a steel I mean, well, and now notice... Three of the five Kavanaugh women admit they all made it up. Democrats all knew that. There's nothing they won't do. And criminals never stop until they're brought to justice. Is the next thing what we need to do to stand up, if necessary, against, uh, against uh, Putin, if it is necessary? was threatening people with today, wasn't it? She was saying, look, it's either this deal or there could be no Brexit at all, was kind of what she was saying to people. So, Rick, you think... You think... I'm totally wrong, and we end up with this no-deal scenario, then I don't see Linda, the banking no raising interest rates that will, for a long time. That that's gonna, certainly not good for guilt, and you've seen a bit of that today. That oh, Karen Moore from J.P. Morgan, got there, there. Good to see you. There is no one. Okay. Still come well, on in King well, Nine. I think a break from Brexit. Who we'll talking their chances at this? David Davis, Boris Johnson, to name but two, uh, both of whom think they could do a better job of this. And yet they don't ever quite. Uh, Rick, come up public and say so. Thank you. Nigel, the good news is that people know, are now more aware of how the EU works. Well, I think they're certainly aware of the way the European Commission works. They're I don't like him, but they're quite good at it, really, aren't they? Uh, Jenny and Barclay says, Nigel, why can't you put party politics aside? I had to join the Tories for the sake of Brexit. Join the party! American help. It was President Macron in a speech in a commemoration of the First World War who said totally right. a lot of big things on that front. Armies, that's a waste of also, the private Federal Reserve trying to sabotage uh, the economy. Trump's threatening to throw all the press 